This is how I live. I live. This is what I love. Oh. This is all the things that my dreams have been made of. Welcome to my life. This is what I love. This is what the soundtrack to my life is made of. Music love life. Crystal Jordan, be honest in myself, Kevin Davis. We are Music Love Life. And here we go again with another episode. Look who's back. Uh-huh. <laughs> Glad you finally showed up. Don't do me like that. Uh-huh. Don't, don't do that. I, you know what? I was so upset that I missed, especially when I heard you all talking about the royal wedding. Oh, you mean how we rocked the wedding? It was such disrespectful commentary. Disrespect. Hey, man. Todd one fist bump. No, no, no. First <laughs> she of was all, dope. did you guys even see the... Did you all even epic. see the, re- the wedding? No. I got up and watched the wedding. See, exactly. That's why you weren't... We were glad Lame. you weren't here for that very reason. No, you needed my commentary because you guys skipped over so many important parts in the royal wedding. I don't want to, you know, totally take us back there, but just for a moment, we why had, don't we? We, we <laughs> had fried chicken. We had... What else did we hit? Oh, my God. Uh, it's just food. We had the fact like that the food she... And and that was and just food, wedding and food. No, yeah, no, we also hit the fact that we're not mad that the, when we lost one of the black chicks. Like, okay, yeah. she's gone. We also said that that he's not lucky. <laughs> that she- yes, yes, yes. I was a little bit ups- upset about that Why? because that is not true. No, he is not lucky. He is. Lucky. She came up. He came down. Oh, no, he, he, <laughs> he has found the love of his life. Come on, really? Oh, yeah, he yeah, has. Princes don't find the love of their life. He did. No, this because, is a Cinderella. No, no, this is Cinderella. Because See, this is that Disney shit me. coming again. No, no, Here no, it no. Is. listen to me. Because his uh-huh. mother married because it was the custom, and she was unhappy, and so he and his brother both have married for love. Oh. You can tell. Like, this is not someone that the royal family- Where did they family, fall in love? This in is Compton? Not, why do people keep saying Compton? Where's okay? where's where should I say? She was South not Central? she <laughs> she was not obviously in Compton. Even then she came from a middle class family. I she think you're too personally invested. Where did they meet? How did they get They how, were actually went on a blind date. Oh, okay. So yeah, from Compton. He was he just happened to be in Compton. He does a lot of they do a lot of charity work and that's how they Charity. That's what this they is. Do. It's charity fil- work. <laughs> you know that's what? That's what this is. This is charity. I'm you know how you that walked you into can't. that. You should have so just sad. left it alone, but you couldn't help it, could you? I'm just so sad that you guys can't Who do you think paid for her? Dress. She didn't. You know she didn't. No, she's not supposed to. What? It, uh-huh. When no. you got married, did you pay for your dress? Well, my situation was different. But lucky. the bride's family. She's lucky. The bride's family is supposed to pay for the dress, but I'm sure the, because the queen has to approve it. What did her family pay for? What is our family going to pay for for the rest of their lives? If that's not important. That's what I'm what saying. What does that have to do with him being focus. lucky? She came up. He's not he lucky. He is in love. He could have picked he anybody. The, he did. He, he picked, picked anybody. the woman that he wanted. Mm. And he went against the stereotype. And I think it's beautiful. Which, which stereotype? Well, the first of all, she's a little bit older than him. Uh-huh. And she's biracial. Okay. And she's not from London. Okay. She's from California. Right. And she's not of royal blood. Okay. She, her parents are divorced. I mean, there's she's di- she's, she's been divorced. Up. Oh, she, she has not blemishes. Fucked up. No, she doesn't. She's she beautiful. Has, the princess she, has blemishes. No, she has no blemishes. She's a beautiful princess, and mm. she's actually a duchess. It's not really a prince. She's a duchess. That's oh, okay. the correct term. But <laughs> I don't think that. How does that change our review of the wedding? I think I think what did a, you guys miss? And and there was the the wedding actually was interesting because there was a African American pastor. <clears throat> that spoke and like delivered a sermon. Seen that a hundred times. On coming right. to but in the but in a British royal wedding though, I don't think so. Like it was totally weird. Randy Watson. Yeah, I think that yeah. was. His thing. It was like God. Like, it, was. it was just like that. It <laughs> right? was very strange. It wasn't, it wasn't anything like that. It was. That's not her background, is it? No, I still yeah. don't understand why he was there. It's, that's what I'm telling you. This is all. This is all make believe. It's all made it's up. Make believe. She beautiful. was. She is the mm-hmm. whitest black person possible. Yeah. She dated yeah. other white guys prior to of Harry. Of course, there's nothing wrong with that. No, I'm not. I'm not, no, I'm just making. I'm, I'm setting my case up. Okay. So what I'm saying is that like having a preacher like that, the fried chicken thing. This, there was no fried chicken. That's what they no, the, they the made Fox the comment. News, the Fox News uh, commentator said that he noticed that there weren't any fried. chicken He was being a or left wing asshole. No, that'd be right wing, maybe left okay, wing or no, right wing. Right wing. Yeah. Okay. okay. Right wing asshole. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. That 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 is that is like the Tiger Woods. Fried chicken and watermelon at the at the um, the master statement. We take offense right. to things like that. You all should have been offended. Well, I was that. offended by the cheese doodles because we don't fuck with cheese doodles. Yeah, it was kind of like cheese. He doesn't know. Black us people at don't all. even eat fried chicken now. Like who does? Yes, they do. No, they don't. Who don't? White, well, white people eat all the you soul food. Eat Popeyes. Yes. But I'm there are a lot of You don't eat fried chicken anymore? I'm no. I, oh, I yeah, you eat, eat jackfruit. fried food. I no, I tried the jackfruit. <laughs> I did tell I did tell, tell for Kevin. 
because he t- you for me. Well, yes. you because you you, you were, mentioned you were it. Thinking of me. Yes, you mentioned it. But how did you have your jackfruit? Did you have it? Was <laughs> Disgustingly. It fried? It, it, <laughs> no, I had. It was a, a was pulled the, pork. It was not a pulled pork sandwich. Okay. <laughs> but it was a jackfruit sandwich. Barbecue. As, right. See, that's what I had, but it was not. It was it covered didn't go in well. barbecue sauce. That's Mine disgusting. was covered in barbecue sauce as well. But it it was weird because it looked like ro- like brisket. Mm-hmm. The texture. So when I, you know, got it, I got ready to take a bite. But it you expected tasted, it to be like it to more be, spongy, like to be like have a, me- a meteor texture. It tasted like barbecue plant. No Not how- even like lettuce or like 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 like. You thought you were just plant. eating miscellaneous plant. It was bad. No matter how <laughs> many jackfruit like you eat, you'll never be Meghan Markle. <laughs> Keep eating that fried chicken, girl. Oh, that's bad. I, you know what? I'm good, but good for her. Good yeah, for her. Good for, we, we're good with it. I girl. thought it was a beautiful good wedding. It. it was a beautiful wedding. I would have no idea. I didn't even see a picture. You didn't see a picture? Nah, for well, what? I'll make sure I show it. Here, I'll pull one No, up. it's okay. I don't need to see it. <laughs> you seen a wedding, you seen a I, I was in a wedding before. I've been in a couple of weddings. No, it's not you seen one, you seen them all. That's not true. I was in a wedding that the person, they spent like $35,000. Were you in it? Yeah. Mm. $35,000? On a wedding? That's that's not that's not abnormal though. That is abnormal. No, it isn't. Not Guess for what a they are? Are they divorced? Divorced. <laughs> <laughs> Less than a decade. Wow. Yeah, I don't I don't think they stay married five years. Yeah, that happens a lot. So do you think they were done paying that thirty five thousand off? Probably I would say not. no. <laughs> you sarcastic. And it's my boy too. We're good. We're great friends. I love him to death. But yeah, I think people feel pressure to create a big, you know. To ceremony, you know what I mean? Like it, it's, it's like a status thing. Well, yeah, because girls have been dreaming about this shit since they were two years old or whatever. Being and, married, being and of married, course to you me love her, so you want to give her what she wants, right? Why do you but blame at the same us time, for it if you pay for it? No, 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 don't no, really no. Give a shit. You know but that's you all. You, for it, yeah, though. we don't want to. Well, but, give, but I'm just saying, if you choice. agree, then, then then we're in this together, and you guys no, no. abandon. T- test your man, ladies. If you're about to get married, ask him if you would prefer just to go to Justice of the Peace or have a small, simple $750 wedding. $750 wedding? Yeah. You can't even get a dress for that. No, no, no. That's on you. The dress, just, that just, dress stuff is on you. You can't get a dress you can, for that. I, what is that, Rainbow? If you can get a prom dress for $5, get, I know you can get a For what? Dress. Go to Rainbow. For how much? $5. You can't get in a prom Somewhere, dress for $5. N- no, man. If I'm not going to do this. You guys know. There's got know. to be some organization. How much does a wedding dress have to cost? It doesn't have to cost anything, but they're usually more than $750. How much? Give me a number. $1,500. Mm, that's a, you, <laughs> you had that ready to go, didn't you? You're messing that budget <laughs> up. That's that's Okay, so we're spending 15 on a dress. Then how much do, the, do you think the wedding should cost more or less than the dress? Well, obviously it has to cost more. Why? See, well, obviously, what right. is that obvious? Okay, thing? but if it depends, it depends on what you're doing. If you're feeding people <laughs> and you want, you know, your uh-huh. guests to enjoy, that's that's really what. Takes so is it the for the money. guests or is it for the us? We're getting See, all that is extra shit. <laughs> all you need is the preacher and the witness. I am so glad that she was you? not here last week. I am not. I am. That's why we're. That's why we're recapping today because you want to be able to have your family and friends join in and celebrate your love. Blah. How much do you? <laughs> how much do you? Propose a wedding. How much is your wedding next wedding going to cost? About ballpark. I know you can't get it. You know. I well, I'm but I'm not. If it was my first wedding, like what I would pay for my daughter's wedding. Yeah. Five thousand. Yeah, that's. I think that's a good normal. How price. much? How much is your funeral going to cost? I'm not. My my grandmother's funeral cost thirteen thousand. <laughs> oh no no, grandma. <laughs> if, no, it's, no. if it's a, that commercial I saw about the funeral home in Memphis is nineteen ninety nine. What? <laughs> There's a funeral home that has <laughs> caskets for nineteen ninety nine. Man, dude jumped up out of the casket. I God saw that. Damn it, I know that. Hey. <laughs> I saw that. Yo, I shit. told y'all come down here and pay for that. <laughs> <laughs> right. What is this? <laughs> it was some ignorant black. Is it nineteen hundred ninety nine dollars? Right. Okay. <laughs> that's said, still, no, not nineteen dollars. Okay, no, well, that's still that's, that's too still, much. That's still very thirteen thousand. Uh, though your grandma, like, ooh, don't don't don't. Was it really nice? I, I'm a, well, I mean, she had a, a very nice. Casket? She had a nice. We wanted her to have a nice casket because she's gonna enjoy. It. She needs to be able to enjoy the, the comforts do, of it. Don't come for my grandma. <laughs> your don't grandma's not in granny. there. That's not your grandma in there. But we wanted her to. We wanted her to be. Is it worm proof? She better be in that in that casket like an Egyptian princess. <laughs> Why you, you guys? No, no. I want to know. I want to know. Is it worm? Is it worm proof? Well, that's not. That's all. Then the ceremony. It was. I mean, that, a lot goes into a funeral. Also, those are sad, you know, uh, circumstances. But it's not cheap. 
I it, think funeral homes be taking advantage they of do. people anyway. They do. Though. They probably do. But like, yeah, that's a time sad. when you can't really, you know, you don't have a lot of time to to you, to you know look for noticed. something cheaper. Mm-hmm. What I've noticed is is that these days, you know, they have the the, the recession or whatever. Oh, not the recession. The the, uh, <laughs> the reception, not the reception. I'm like, what is the it? <laughs> <laughs> no, look. So you're at the church mm-hmm. or whatever and for the wedding or the, funeral. The, the, Which funeral, way are we going? Funeral. Okay, funeral. They're, the viewing or whatever. Then everybody jumps in cars and drives to the graveyard. Yes. But now they don't even let you see them taking the the casket down anymore. Yeah. Are you sure she's still in that thirteen thousand dollar casket? Don't do, don't 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 come for my granny. Switching we them did, out. We Switching did. them no, out. They're not. No, <laughs> I didn't do that. That is. He's, I, I didn't, I didn't like my funny. sound effect. That's not funny. It would sound way that. that's more funny. thuddy than that. It wouldn't that's sound not, that poppy. That's not, nice, that's not like a pop. It's more of a thud. No, but honestly, though, I'm, I'm getting nice. I'm getting cremated, and I don't care how much like like I don't care how much the urn cost or whatever. You know, they cremate people when they don't have a family. Like if a person dies and they have no family or no relatives, they just cremate that person and they don't even like. That's good. I think I want to be cremated, no. but like sprinkle my ashes in like like how high I want to grow it, become a tree or something. Sprinkle me. Mm. I missed. Actually, this. yeah, I'm gonna put that. <laughs> I in my, really missed this. I'm okay. just saying, I'm gonna put that in my will. Sprinkle me. I'm just saying those are the two ceremonies that we spend way too much on. That's why I brought funerals? it up. Funeral, mm. funerals, and weddings. I don't think so. I yeah, think absolutely. with a funeral, you know, with a funeral, you know, if you obviously most people have, well, most people have life insurance that covers. That should cover your funeral. Yeah, but okay, so thirteen. let's say that there was $13,000 in a life insurance policy. Oh, it was wouldn't, more than that. I know, but wouldn't it have been much better if we spent maybe $750 on the funeral no. and then the rest of that money goes to no, someone? No, we wanted to make sure that, no. If you have someone, I don't know how recently, and, and thank God, my, my grandmother's been passed away for about two years now, so I'm not... It's going to go it. off on you all like Why I really you go would. On my, my grandparents because you're have being died. super insensitive no. to you death. You know, you could date a white person now too, actually. What? You could date, you know, that your grandma's dead. You can date a white person. I could date a white person even when my grandmother was alive. Nah, yes, I could. I would. I, you I couldn't would. take him back. Mm. I, I would too. Yes, yes. I would too. Your grandma stop answering your calls. No, my granny would not. Baby, why smell like wet dogs? <laughs> yeah. oh, my God. granny was not that type of granny. <laughs> what? I said, you smell that? My granny was not that type of granny. Oh. <laughs> my granny actually was like, like she didn't bake or. What? Anything like that? She like, <laughs> she had like lots of men, like you boyfriends, had and so yeah, she was Wait, like a hot mama. Your granny used to run a brothel or something. No, she was just she was, a madam. She was hot. Yeah, you know, it wasn't a madam. Yeah. But she just, you know, she was a real. Your grandma used to sell pistols. Not, no, she did have a lot of guns around the house, though. What? Yeah, like, she granny, sold why do you have so many guns? You no, you were too green. Your grandma sold pistols. Well, I, yeah, no, uh, she didn't sell pistols. They kept you out of the life. No. It's probably a whole You can't whole get a slingshot shit. For $25 baby <laughs> Stop making that voice Like she's not like An old she whack wasn't. grandma Obviously She was not I mean, it's, cool. it's the grandma voice It I cost $13,000 This was better than mine It cost $13,000 To put in the ground She couldn't have been A regular grandma How much do Anyway I don't think my My grandparents funerals Cost that much And I'm, and I'm glad they didn't it, This but what is the what what is the problem though What's Some the things point? are bigger than money Like money mm. Is not important When it comes to that I don't think I would have preferred I, I would rather say A wedding should be Less expensive Than a funeral A funeral is like mm. That You're That is a It's It's I I don't think you should 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 like Scrimp on a funeral I don't think you should Just spare no expense We are gonna send you To heaven she in should, style She should have took That last twelve hundred And some dollars And went to Vegas Right before she passed She then, uh, Trust me She went everywhere She wanted to go This was rocket. this. Was, she she enjoyed She lived life To the fullest Okay Okay well, You say so I, don't, I think that's why Them old people Be at spring break Dancing and shit I've never middle. seen that You never seen Any of those videos where I saw it like, in the movie Cocoon <laughs> I, I love your grandmother Okay, no I'm more. Sure she was a wonderful lady. No more jokes about. You see, we had to take a break because Crystal got mad at us about because they're being extremely insensitive, and that is not. That is not. We love all funny. old wrinkly people. We're not going to make any more what? jokes about oh them. Oh my god! Do we have to stop again? <laughs> do, we need, do we need to stop taping again? <laughs> hey, running a gun shop is an honorable profession. My granny did not and run being a, a madam. gun shop. Oh, you know what she probably was? A house mom at a strip club. You know, they make a lot of money because the, when the stripper comes in, they got to pay the DJ. They tip out. They got to pay the DJ and the house mom. Like, they don't even do anything. DJ, all, does, all y'all broke ass niggas, y'all need to spend some money or go home. That's what DJ does. <laughs> the house mom doesn't really doesn't do shit. She keeps 
Get the girls together because they she fight. Make sure that everything is nothing okay. like a naked fight. It was your grandmother in the middle of that. I would have, I would have been her intern. She was not in the middle of that. There's nothing like a naked fight. No, in but a strip I did club. notice that. I remember one time I went to the gas station with my granny. She had a like a tank top. This is it was just weird grandmother material. All right, grandmother thing and 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 Cotton. she they called her cupcake. The, the guys <laughs> at the yeah she was cupcake. She, was, she had a nickname prior to you knowing her. She did, and she I mean she was still cupcake even then. Yeah. Mm. Did a guy just come by? Tell your grandmama Daryl came by. <laughs> yeah, she had Daryl said hi. She was a popular lady. <laughs> <laughs> she told me that at church, all the deacons next snap, and she walked by. She oh. Was, mm-hmm. okay. she was a little jazzy lady. Yeah, yeah that's she, what okay. I'm talking about. Yeah, that's that's all right. She might have deserved that 13K. Mm-hmm. Well, you know, I think everybody's gran- granny deserves that. Mm-hmm. I don't know about everybody. Yeah, I think so. I, mean, I don't think some real mean grandmas. Anyway, what are we talking about? <laughs> I don't fucking know anymore. I feel like I feel like the whole world is falling apart. There's too much crazy shit going on. Yeah, I'm so sick of social media at this point. Like I just can't. We are getting our news. You guys realize news is is comes basically through Instagram. Yep. Basically. Not to like, me, because I don't look at Instagram, but yeah. Wow. Like that's why you never know what's going on when we text you and you're like, no, hey, no, have no. you seen this? You're like, no. I know what's going on. on you are you are like that like grandpa that's been in the back yeah, room. Yeah, it's because he's not on what? Instagram. <laughs> <laughs> what no, happened? I haven't seen that. We're like, hey, have you seen this? No. Okay. And look, and who's the least scarred? Me. <laughs> that's, what, that's what the crazy part is. You guys come here all stressed out and angry at, at life and shit. And I'm telling you, hey, life is okay. You know what I'm saying? I got real people problems. I got problems that, you know, like, be like family shit. Like, y'all worried about Donald Trump and who knows who else. You do have the dirtiest of old man statements, though. Anything, if <laughs> like we ask you about, birdie? oh, that motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I do it that. It comes straight filth. It, 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 Pure it, filth. It just doesn't have a filter. Oh. And uh-oh. old people don't have filters. Uh-oh. I can't wait to get that old. I can't wait. I think you can just do it whenever, though. Yeah, you could. I think you can just mm-hmm. do it whenever. I think I'm young enough to still have consequences. Nah, you only have consequences if you if you believe you have consequences. Like, people are still mad at Bill Cosby for saying that black people need to pull their pants up and but shit they like do, that. But they do need to pull their pants up. not why they're mad at Bill Cosby anymore. I don't well, think anyone's was thinking about that. It was before. I don't think people are even thinking about that. That whole thing just kind of went away. Was it the pound cake speech? Or I whatever? mean, as soon as the other stuff started coming out, then they were like, now that motherfucker's going to get what he deserves. <laughs> he does sound like Dave Chappelle when he does that. <laughs> you know that Not he, on purpose. He does it on purpose. <laughs> you know that he's his likeness for a charity foundation, right? I remember. Okay. Uh, I remember. And he actually won the scholarship. Went to the yeah. Day. yeah, he won yeah. a lot of money. So what sure. right now, Kevin, what is so crazy? Because I mean, you know, you, you made the statement that everything is going crazy in the world. What right now is Well, Trump. I mean, Trump is always at the basis of most of the crazy stuff. Roseanne, Roseanne got canceled. Roseanne and Roseanne got canceled. As she should. First of all, have you guys did it you guys was on even for know what, 10 minutes? Did you guys even know that Roseanne was back? Like with every yeah. single it was, original, breaking, it was breaking records. Yeah. yeah, every single original cast member, which, which was amazing to me. Like, it's so weird to see them all like twenty years later. Yeah, it was weird. I watched it a few times. It was like it was I like did. an odd version of Fuller House. Yeah, yeah. It wasn't yeah. funny. I didn't think mm. it was funny. I thought it was obvious they were pushing a political agenda. But this is my thing. The show had like a gay son. Like one of Roseanne's daughters has got a gay tr- transgender son who you know is dresses like a little girl. He's a Forced. little boy. Yeah, it's it's super like they were they were trying to push an agenda. So for her to so I and then there was obviously the presidential uh, tension where they tried to bring up the conversation of the presidential race. I didn't realize that Roseanne was a big Trump supporter. That came out. I, I I hadn't been following Roseanne Barr since the first Roseanne. Was it so. funny well, that back was, in the day to you? It was, I thought it was, was funny, it funny back in the day. I didn't think that it was funny yeah, now. Not really. I mean, it, it was funnier. The original season was... Right. I mean, the original shows were funnier before. The newer ones was kind of like... Mm. It, it wasn't funny. You mean the... the I would changed. rather see Married with Children make a comeback. Married yeah. with Children is the best. Yeah. It was the best white comedy ever. I'm trying to figure out which one like... Married with children are friends. I don't. I don't think that that's what everybody else would say. Married with children are friends. That's yeah. not even a conversation. Yeah, not to me either. Really? Friends, Which is, one? friends was corny. Oh, but I, Seinfeld right. is the best white sitcom of all time. You're right. You're yeah, right. I, I, but I, Married with Children is, is I, really I'll close. I put Married with that. Children against Seinfeld. I think I that. think yeah, black was, people like Married with Children more than Seinfeld. But no, I like Seinfeld too. You liked it more than Married with Children. I, I think Seinfeld was the best, but that's because 
it just the humor was just smart and witty. And Married with Children was more like I never watched Seinfeld. I don't think I've ever seen an entire episode. I thought we were bonding on that. Yeah, I think Seinfeld was witty, was was wittier jokes, but uh, the Married with Children was one liners. It was just ignorant. So it, was it, just, was, it was. It was pure. It was anti lesbian, anti woman. It was anti yeah. kids. It was like yeah. anti everything. It was. It was hilarious. How could, how could you like a show was, better than that? It was that? brilliant. <laughs> I it, it was like curmudgeon, curmudgeon heaven. It, it was. It was. It was like, <laughs> like I guess like how South Park and that kind of stuff. Like that was the first like. He's just saying whatever he wants to say, stuff that everybody else wishes <laughs> yeah, they could they're say. Yeah, all, they're all married with children's children. Like, yeah. But, okay. Now, Roseanne made a racist comment. Well, she made a racist tweet. And I actually thought, so she made a tweet about... Um, I don't like old people on Twitter, first of all. <laughs> Obama's... Um, what, what was her actual position? She was like... <laughs> A, one of the Obama's His person. staff members, <laughs> Obama person. Right. She said that the woman in looked of Obama. like a Muslim. If a Muslim and and a Planet of the Apes had a baby, yeah, which is like that can't get more racist. Yeah, I don't. I mean, that's that is just ra- it's 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 everything. It's everything yeah. all in one. And then she tweeted it. No, and first of all, I read I read that the um the network ABC actually had. Talked to her about tweeting before because I guess she's had some issues. You know, she makes a lot of you know right. really crass tweets. So they they had tweeting. mentioned that they didn't want her to really tweet. Her kids had taken away her Twitter account when she first got back on the Roseanne show. Right, and they were like, "Don't do this." So the fact that she got a hold of Twitter, got back on Twitter, and then tweeted this out, and then afterwards, after the backlash starts, <laughs> John Goodman was like, "Oh, this is very dangerous." Somebody else on the show, oh, um, Wanda Sykes, who was the producer, immediately quit, and then Roseanne issues an apology, hoping that she can kind of, you know, stop the bleeding, and she says that she's sorry. She wished she um, she should not have made a, a racist. No, she shouldn't have made a, a, a statement against Muslims because Muslims is not a race; it's, it's a culture. But she never talked about the Planet of the Apes remark. Um, are, are apes offended? Was was Caesar like? God that's damn not it. you got. But I mean, we all know that that's a reference against right. African Americans. But she wouldn't even address that. Well, she I mean, just addressed okay, can, the religious. Can, can, can we be for real though? Like we're all apes, all of us, in a sense. But not. What? But, we, okay. Who the if fuck you is believe, an ape? If you believe in, in evolution, then oh, you don't you believe know. in evolution. I don't. You don't believe in evolution either. No, no. <laughs> Oh my god, you guys are idiots! I ain't come from no- <laughs> you guys are idiots. If I, if I came from monkeys, why the fuck are there still monkeys? You you are. I am. You're not. a primate. You guys okay. are idiots. Yeah. Hey, look, but look though, I ain't never seen no monkey. I with didn't these know idiots. that. I, I did not know I was on the show with these kind of people. I apologize. Really? I, I apologize oh, to all with of these you, people with these these kind of people. You I, people. I, but to be fair, she does have a special look. I don't think it's necessarily. Are you really doing this? Right I, don't, now? I don't think it's Muslim a, ape-y. A Special look. She has a special look. Oh, that's that's. What, a, what would you say she looks like? If you had to make a joke on Twitter, like replace Roseanne's tweet. Go ahead, you're, prepare repl- yours. I, I'm coming, I don't I'm have you a now. tweet. Nah, I, I don't have a tweet. That's, I don't. That's too. It's too low a bar. What? It's too low. What do you bar. mean? She's spe- she has a special look, right? But people, okay. First of all, <laughs> I know a lot of people with a special does look. She I call have a special ugly. look. Ugly. So she's ugly. Eh, she ain't cute. So she's no, 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 no. We're she not going to do this. We're not going to do this because, first of all, there's no reason to be tweeting about how people look. Adults no. don't do that. No, come on. Adults what? don't do she's that. She's a comedian. Stop that. Don't do that. She's a comedian. That's what's wrong with America right now is we don't have any more comedians because we're telling them all to be quiet. I do feel like this was ridiculous, though. What she said, she should have got her show. It, it was beyond. It was beyond. It should have got her show canceled. She should be. It was, it was blatantly racist. And, and it, just st- stupidly it, racist. It, it was worse than the che- cheese doodles The cheese comment. doodle line, yeah. Yeah. Because it was obvious he had no idea what the fuck he was talking about. Then she, she, but I saw, I guess a week, a couple of weeks ago, she made a statement. She tweeted uh, Chelsea Clinton and called her Chelsea Gross Clinton because there's a, a Soros. Yeah, Uh, Soros. Yeah, Yeah. I said Gross. Soros, yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. And, and after Chelsea Clinton, who had a very, um, and a very, a great comeback, she was like, you know, I don't know who you're talking about. That's not my middle name. She, but she did kind of. This nonprofit you go is low, great. I'll go high. She did. She took the high road. Then Roseanne comes back and says, "Well, did you know that Soros was a, a anti-Semitic, a Nazi that you know killed people? But we all make mistakes in that, right, Chelsea? Like she's just a horrible old 
woman. It was dark. Yeah, like it was, it was disgusting. I mean, but she still is a comedian. Still, she is a comedian. But I would I mean, like for our comedians to be funny when they're taking stabs at people, though. But are they? That, but is that I, the proper? I think that's a key point. Yeah. I think that's a key point. But is that the proper you form gonna, for that though? I mean, yes, if Twitter if is a stand up. Do you, yes. Oh my god, the internet is fucking awful. So it's okay for just random. Invisible dude to put all these memes up about people saying whatever and whenever. People troll all the time. I see terrible all, jokes, and all it's the hilarious. Time. It just has to be funny, Roseanne. If you're gonna yeah. make a, if you're gonna make a joke, try not to make it racist. But if it's racist, it's got to be really funny. It's got to be really funny. I give you that. Actually, all my all the my favorite races are hilarious. <laughs> what they are? Who are your favorite races? Have you have you ever like gone <laughs> online and just like googled just like googled nigger jokes? No, There's I haven't. I've never done that. I've never even thought oh. to do that. What are you looking for in it's your life? It's hilarious. <laughs> Why did you do that? Why did I Google nigger jokes? You want to know yes. more about yourself? No, I was what passing the time. I did but she was I, fucking hilarious. I want to learn about You've myself. Never just, this in a, is in a funny tab, negative. In the age of information, like in the age of information, you're you never looking, tell me that you just searching. Google some shit that you wanted to know. That sounds like when a guy like, says, if do, you go looking for something, you're gonna you're gonna nah, find I, it. You ever been curious? You are like, looking what do, for racist what issues. Do race, what do racist people say about us? No. Hmm. <laughs> Nigger jokes. <laughs> Wow, oh, that's wild. That is crazy. That is wild. We haven't covered so much about Kevin on the show. Like, I can't be the only one. You are the only one. I cannot be the only one I that's Google nigger jokes. My Google Googled search has never that has never come up in my. And you know what? I don't even yeah. think to Give do that. Give me some nigger jokes in the comments. I want to see. see a tell, post wow. a link. Let me see what do you that found. Because maybe, maybe they are. No, maybe Roseanne not. will tweet in. Nigger yeah, jokes are hilarious. <laughs> so, so I don't know. If Roseanne didn't. Surely she realized the president of ABC is a black woman. I didn't even know black that. girl magic. I don't know about magic. I didn't even know that. though. How did she not know though? Roseanne should have known. She should have known. That's what I'm like, saying. It's just very strange. Because every time white people say some Wanda racist Sykes shit, Wanda Sykes is her executive producer. Yeah, that's stupid. You, you, you're too close. Yeah, but every time white people say some racist shit, oh, they didn't know. They don't know. But no I mean, obviously, she. I mean, who could have known? She didn't. I'm sure she didn't. Uh, sabotage wasn't trying to get fired. I mean, a lot of people it's lost just their like jobs. When the white girl, it's was? just like when the white girl said nigga mm-hmm. on Kendrick Lamar stage. I didn't know. Did I say it? Was the, was that me? To be Why fair, people always oblivious. To be man? fair, he That's brought her on stage to say a, a to line that song. had nigga in it. I always wonder that. Like, what do what what are we expecting white people to do? When that's because I see, I, in fact, I was in a meeting with a friend of mine, music industry colleague, mm-hmm. meeting with a white woman who was a manager of a biracial artist, <laughs> and she said the n word. It threw me off. Right? Sure she so wasn't. Was she like, wasn't biracial. No, no way. No, she's not biracial. And she said she's like I'm the whitest person. Da da da. But she's just cool. But she just said it, and I was just like, I looked at the and guy. You were just stunned, like, I was stunned because I could. I was like, "What just happened?" You didn't say anything, and I didn't say anything. And you the guy acted like he didn't hear it. Wow. Yeah. See, both of y'all punked out. What were we supposed to do? It was a very uncomfortable. It would have been an uncomfortable moment at that point. Like, yeah. check her about saying the n word, but the song, the the artist that she represents uses the word. Like, but she she did say it like we were just all cool. Like y'all all like, niggas. We all niggas. My yeah. niggas. What's up, my nigga? Yeah. How did she say it? I'm, I'm just interested now. Like, do you remember the exact... It was kind of like that. White like, people, like... if any black people <laughs> want you to say the word nigga, your only job is to appear nervous. <laughs> she was not ner- She said it like it was normal. That's you appear nervous. And I know no. another white person in the music industry that... He, you can't look too comfortable. He looked very comfortable saying it. Mm-hmm. But his client who was black told him he could say it. He got a pass. And I was no. just like, how how can one black person give you a pass? Can't. They can't do that. I bet Leor Cohen says it. I bet he does. I bet he does. Oh, he no. Was, hold he on. Was, Leor Cohen was right but, there but, when Kanye did the MAGA, MAGA hat. That was Leor Cohen yeah, over yeah. his shoulder. Everybody mm-hmm. says it. You, you mean in public. You mean to black He probably people. says it in the company of, of black people. Of some everybody of the com- people that he's made a lot of money for. Make no mistake. Everybody says nigga. I'm talking about Arabs, uh, <laughs> Chinese people. Everybody says it. It's just that some people choose to say it in front of black people. What would they? I I did think that would be funny if they said it with an accent. <laughs> How would that sound? That's hilarious. Let me see said, your impression. I don't have one. But okay, <laughs> back, so Roseanne, Roseanne said it. She immediately ABC responded. Like I do like the fact that ABC and I have to give a kudos to Starbucks because the way they handled it quickly, 
making sure that people knew that they don't stand behind those racist remarks makes everybody feel more comfortable, I think. So I think the ABC did a great job. I mean, I hate that all those actors and those, everyone on that show, like They'll that show, jobs. And they, well, I mean, it's not always no, that easy. I've never seen any of those other people except Tom Arnold. Tom Arnold, no, John Goodman, you mean. John Goodman, John yeah. Goodman. Yeah, but all Tom the Arnold behind too, the scenes yeah. people, the camera people, the editors. It's, oh, not, yeah, always, yeah, it's not always that well, easy, the though. Daughter, they're a union. The daughter actually made a, a tweet about it. It was like, how dare you speak for all of us? Yeah, because she's very much... But this is my thing. The show was about, you know, that one of the, the, the granddaughters was black, another one was a, a gay, like... Trump is anti everything that Roseanne claims she's for. You know what I mean? So for her to be a big Trump supporter and, and Trump is anti everything that's not conservative How, white male. Wasn't, weren't, weren't Trump and Roseanne, weren't they at odds before? Or are they friends? Yeah, well, they became friends. But years ago when Roseanne, do you guys remember when Roseanne sung the, Amer- the national anthem mm-hmm. and like pissed America off? And Trump was one of the people that said something derogatory about her back then. I don't know. I guess they became good buddies because Roseanne actually like said she was one of the only people in Hollywood that were that was an open supporter of Trump. Like, how did this vocal. become about Trump all of a sudden? Because well, Trump, okay, so Trump's son retweeted Trump's everything. Trump's son retweeted what Donald Trump Jr. retweeted what Roseanne. What did Donald posted. Trump do? How are we attacking he him? Has, he, he has retweeted the 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 Planet of the Apes. The son, that the son, comment? the son did. Mm, interesting. Yeah, but wow. but I think the Fruit fact that Donald far. Trump the the fact that Donald Trump congratulated her about the show and they've been chummy since he was in office. Um, and then, of course, with his son retweeting it, it just kind of all feels like... Something else to blame Trump for. I got you. No. I'm no. just waiting. I'm he's just waiting. In, he's in all the mess. I'm, no, he's not. I'm waiting, he's I'm waiting all it all to happen because y'all been talking shit for over a year now and he's still in the presidency. He's still he's a not. president. That's why what, that's what someone said, how is Roseanne fired immediately for saying something? And Trump says stuff all the time. He said anyone that doesn't... Uh, Stop! What bow their head for the national anthem should be kicked out of the country? Like he says all kinds of. Who is stuff. he beholden mm-hmm. to, though? No one, I guess. But and I guess Roseanne was beholden to ABC, so yeah, ABC she's got on their what, what did you say at that time? You said how, what kind of money does does Trump have? Oh no! Where, where accusations just bounce off of him? Like <laughs> I don't remember. I don't know, He's got man. it though. Yeah, whatever. I, I forget he spent the phrase. His own, he spent his own money. There was a so. witty yeah. phrase. Yeah. 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 So um, I'm not mad it's canceled. She'll probably get get on somewhere else doing something else. This is my. Canceled. I wonder if another another network will pick it up. Somebody was saying uh, she'll probably sign it at Fox for double. I don't know why people have such a. They negative, probably will take her up as a. Why does people? Why do people have such a negative opinion opinion of Fox TV? Now it, I know Fox News is very one sided and it you know is conservative and sometimes overly so to the point where they're offensive. But Fox TV, we've all watched and loved Fox shows. Mary with Children was a Fox show. It was Martin a Fox was a Fox show. show. But that's yeah. the Bernie point. Mac I show, think that, that Living Color. Yeah, I think but we're that not Fox, talking about that. No, I think that Fox has um, uh, a reputation of of doing things outside the box. Mary with Children was not would not have worked on NBC. No. or ABC. Empire actually. Empire also. You know, is yeah. one of those shows that pushes the boundaries and it's on Fox. So I think Fox just has a reputation of of kind of having things that are. A little bit more racy Edgy. and doesn't, yeah, don't fit the conservative, you know. Very, so that's very why she'll be there, not because they're right wing. I do think Negro that they're haters. also connect. There's also a connection with them being very white, right wing as far as the, their outlook and you know Trump. The news or the whole network. Well, I think you. I don't it's think hard to what's right wing about the news network. What's, the news network is the axis of evil. Right, the Fox News. Yeah, but I'm talking about Fox, the the, the, network. the network, because there's FS1, there's Fox Sports, like they they empo- they employ so many black people. Yeah, and Atlanta is one of my favorite shows. Donald Glover, it's it's on FX. I don't know if that's the that's Fox. not the same thing. Yeah. That's, that's is not, not no no. Okay, well then. <laughs> oh damn, there's a letter missing out of that. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, <laughs> yes, Donald it is. Wait not, a it's I'm not. Gonna, it's not. It's not. Oh my God! Go ahead, continue. It, it is. You can look that up, but that's a waste of time. Right. Oh my God! Hey, okay, man. so uh, <laughs> no, I think it's because Fox has edgier type shows. That was really that's bad. I think, that's it's, a, under, I think it's under their umbrella. It's not. No, it, it, it isn't. totally isn't. It's, yeah, it totally it's really, isn't. It's two very different things. <laughs> FX is short for effects. It's very it's, different it's, it's programming. A cute, it's a cute way of saying effects. Yeah, yeah, it's very different programming, Kevin. I'm not willing to let it go. Okay, Empire, well. okay well, okay. Ah, Fox and National Geographic, FX. No, Kevin, no. 
Did you what? Did you prove it? <laughs> no, yes, I'm going to do it. <laughs> he didn't prove that. He didn't. I'm prove determined. That. You might. I'm, like, I'm so sorry. <laughs> yeah. I'm so sorry. Um, no. So yes, I think that's why because it's got edgier programming right. and maybe I don't know. I don't even know if the rest of the Cavs would want to do it at this I, point. I, I didn't watch one episode. I didn't watch Roseanne back in the day. I didn't think it was funny then. So I thought she was funny. Sometimes. I'm not one of those people. It was very satirical. She's it's, a female comedian though, so there's that. What do you mean? They're not funny. Oh yeah, they're not as funny. Yeah. What else? Moving on. <laughs> what else happened? <laughs> oh my god! So are you are, are you a LeBron fan? Yeah. That's like the huge. Yeah. I saw a picture of LeBron as Thanos. Did you uh, Thanos? Did you guys see that? I did see that. Yes. That was kind of cool, right? I'm 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 ready for him to win this final so that people can really. Let go of that whole Michael Jordan is the greatest ever thing, and we can have a conversation. Are you serious? Yeah, I want to have a I want to have the real conversation because I feel like LeBron is a, is. I mean, the funny thing is, I'm not a LeBron fan, but I've been forced to be because he's just amazing. No, because y'all hate him so much. Oh God, that I, it's just like the natural contrarian in me has to be like, what is wrong with y'all? Like this dude is basically gonna beat all the stats of everybody. Right. He's a, he's a, he's beating teams that he shouldn't beat. Just with his own by will. That's I'm not, what I'm saying. I won't say by himself. He's still got NBA players on the team with him. Right. But for the most part, he's you know he's willing this ha- he's willing this to happen. But ha. but then off the court, oh my god, off the court, the dude is, a, is an amazing guy, man. I, maybe he's yeah, yeah. I mean, he has television shows. No, nah, just that I mean, like he really gives back. Like yeah, uh, you weren't here, but I was telling Kevin he gave forty one million dollars to, to the University of Akron so that thirteen hundred students wow. can go there for free. Wow. Like what type yeah, I mean, of nigga he's, he's, is this? Like, like how do you what, how what do is wrong with y'all? Yeah, but Michael Jordan was amazing. Mm. I just think the comparisons are they should they should unnecessary. be necessary. Yeah, but Michael Jordan was, wasn't as a great humanitarian off the court. But that's not no, what he wasn't at all. Basketball is not about that though. That's it's not. It, but, I'm, but I'm saying it's hard for me to right. to diss LeBron when I know. Yeah, I don't that understand he, why people. He are took so all upset. his friends with him from his growing up and yeah. gave him businesses. Yeah, and uh, they're like with him. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Like he's, he, he married, married his, his high school he sweetheart. His high school and sweetheart. she's a regular black chick. She ain't no uh, Instagram model. Like he's he's the yeah, epitome he's of what dude. we want people to be. And then we call him a bitch. We call him a crybaby. We say he doesn't have any killer instinct. Like yeah. that's ridiculous. It is ridiculous. He's never been arrested. And he's taking Cleveland to the finals. For what, the ninth time? He, this is the eighth time in a row. Eighth time? Eighth time in a row. I think hey, that man. there's a backlash against anything By great. <laughs> anything great. Like Beyonce, right? No. Yeah. Black and great. Same thing as Beyonce. No. Black yep. excellence. It's just too, it's just too good. <laughs> you, got a, you got a backlash against it. Come on. Come Not on. giving it to See? Beyonce. Sorry. Yeah, how can you say Talk that? Talk to him. That's the guy you need to be talking to. <laughs> but I'm just saying, I'm using an example of something that's so good no, she's that not people that great just automatically she is she is that good. Not she's to me. that good. I don't I don't see the I don't see the resemblance at it's all. It's the same thing. <laughs> it's the fact that whenever something is so good, people have to hate it. They have to hate. Haters have to I'm hate. I'm not hating. I just mm, dangerously in love. Let's stop there. No, no, we must continue. Uh, yeah, we got him. I stopped. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> past that. I stopped. Anyway, so yeah, I do like LeBron, but I and I'm growing to like him more because right. He's people hate around. people hate him so much, and I'm like I just can't allow that to happen around me because I just feel like it's it's there's so many great things that we should be holding him up for. We feel the same way about Beyonce. <sighs> this is not going anywhere. <laughs> I'm just let's, I'm just saying, next? don't be a hypocrite. What's okay, next? I'm Come not. On. Who who else? Come who, on. who who would you put in Beyonce's slot if not her? Then who? You see, you're assuming there has to be somebody there. There don't have to be anybody there. The greatest entertainer. Did she get forty one million out. to Houston? She's University given of Houston? her, her uh, Jay Z and Beyonce have given a lot of of to Flint, Michigan. They they, they mm. do a lot of of awesome. Of, um, they bailed out protesters. Yeah, I heard Bill that. Up, I heard yeah. that. Yeah. 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 Can, well, can we move on? The next topic. <laughs> you are just as, next topic. Uh, hypocritical as you want to be. <laughs> yeah. Well, human. I'm human. We got gotcha. you. I'm only human. Yeah. We got so. I think he's mad that Roseanne is canceled now. I'm not mad at all. Really I, uh, that was a dumb comment, and it deserved to be canceled. It is. I'm glad. I'm glad you acknowledge it was. It was racist, and it was. It was big. It just was an example of the worst thing that you can tweet out there. So I'm amazed that it happened so quick. Black people aren't used to getting wins. Like I'm this. not. I'm not amazed. Yeah. This is what had, I need you guys. Um, this is a moment, okay? This, we're gonna have a break through tonight. <laughs> when real racism happens, people react. 
White people also hate racism. No, this no, no, is no, no, not no, true no, no, because no. we've seen so no. many police like, officers no. have killed people. But we don't no know one... that that's racism. That's what I'm saying. We know this is it, this is what? obviously overt racism. The things you're talking about, we weren't there to know all the details surrounding all of that. What I'm saying is, right now, there's no way to say this is anything other than racism. And when this happened. Immediately it was reacted to And immediately it was shut down They canceled her shit Get her out of here It's done Nobody's complaining Nobody's crying for her it's, That's done But the, but the that- message that's being sent right now Is that a black woman said Uh uh-uh. uh Fuck that shit Next no, I don't. They, she hit the button. They, they're saying that the, that's what the social president, media. That's what social button. media. Is they're perverting saying. it again, and that's what I'm saying. They've been perverting us this whole time with this whole. Ra- everything is racist. Everything is racist. If there's a white person and a black person, racism every single time. This is what happens when racism happens. White people also do not like it. If that's the case, then we wouldn't see so many of these police beatings that, that turn that to isn't murders. Necessarily, yes, racism. they are because you can, mm. it, because we see other police. Situations with white people I've seen white people Get beat the fuck up But not killed Not killed be honest Not killed So that's a different thing You don't think white people Get killed by the police Not at the same rate That black Are you joking Look at the stats for real Because you didn't I don't think you've really Looked at the stats I'm not saying that white people Don't get killed by the police But It's just not videotape If white people kill everybody The police don't kill them That's true that's a good point. That is not true. That is not a good point. What? That is no, a good point. No, it absolutely because is. The, facts. That because because is not the, a good the point. School Super shootings, facts. The, 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 the school the shootings. The school shootings. The mass shooters. The school shootings. The mass shooters. are able to calmly resolve those situations. You know situations. why? Because those police shoot, I mean, those school shooters, they're calmly get, get arrested. That's not fair. You got to uh, But there's video of these guys not doing anything and the police still going in on not doing You mean to tell me these dudes kick in the door of an elementary school, shoot everybody like they... Terminator 2000 And then when the police Show up They just Yes But be honest There's a lot There's there's, there's, there's several videos Of guys not Anytime the police Shoot you in the back Right Or there's there's, there's, So getting shot in the back Is racism That's what I'm saying It's a slippery slope If we're gonna do that Racism thing Just because A white person Did something to a black person That's a slippery slope What I'm saying is when we see racism and it's provable and it's obvious and it's overt, it gets handled immediately because I I think nobody likes illness, racism. I think mental Ill, like racism, especially nowadays, is is more. It I, I wish there was more racism that was overt, like what okay. Roseanne said, <laughs> right. because I mean that stuff is easy is easy to prove, right? But most of it is covert. Yes, most of it is when when they don't hire you right. and you don't know why. But is right? it is it fair most then to make it, that assumption just because it exists that everybody is doing it? That's what I'm asking mm, you. It's not fair. It's not a fair assumption to assume that because I think it exists, that's relative. everybody's fair doing it. to whom. Fair to truth We're talking about truth That's all we're talking about Is it fair to truth That just because Racism does exist That everybody white Is practicing it Of course not Of course not That's not what no. we're saying That's what I'm saying though I, I don't think that's That's our point But I think part of I think part of What racism is Are people Whom may unknowingly uh, Participate in it and we can't quantify more, that. Don't more. do it. Yes, but we can't like quantify just, that. Yes, we, can. What we can quantify is... I didn't is, know that this well, was happening. And well, that's we, what white people always do. I didn't know. Well, once, I didn't once, we know. Quantify, once we quantify it, then the, if nothing is done in a quantifiable showing of racism, that's when you get mad. Because this is obvious. Look at what's going on. You're just going to let that happen. Fine. Now you're saying to us that even though it's, it's impossible to be anything other than racism, you're still not going to react. I think the fact that like what Starbucks did was great. They, they, this happened. They said, this is not what we support. Let's do some training. Because I do think there's, there are differences that people aren't obvious racist, but they may harbor feelings. On both sides, and Starbucks the, was closed today. For, they, they closed to do the to do happy, the happy uh, training. Closed. Yeah. And let's do some ridiculous training that nobody's going to pay attention to. That's not ridiculous training. Nobody's that paying is, attention. It is. Training. It's diversity nobody, training. Nobody. Nobody's paying common, attention to that training. Common did was was used. I don't know in how many. I don't know how long if you've ever been in corporate America. All nobody pays attention. Remember, to those you remember videos. that yellow light training they had? Mm. Like when a girl says this, you yellow light. <laughs> Come on, man. <laughs> I mean, sexual harassment. They they and as soon as you get hired on, they make you watch all those H. R videos, right. and yeah. but I think if they put some things in place, so that way that they're protected, they set against precedent. That. Yeah, set precedent. I yeah, do think but as soon as those videos go over, they do all the shit that was in the video. We don't know that. Yes, they do. We don't know that. I'm, yes, I'm just, they do. Maybe there will be a precedent for what what this this 
This denotes calling the police. This does not. This is what is acceptable in Starbucks. I mean, I think all those things that might have been intangible. You know, like I want to see this video. I guarantee you, you'll never see this video. No, I've, I've got to. I saw you made a plea on your Facebook. Page yes, because no I'm responded. sure. I'm, I'm. I guarantee you that they got a black person to. They host got the Com- video. Common. Common was one of the people that was common. The yeah. No, I was being facetious. <laughs> no. no. There's no. Of course. There's no more. I mean, common is like who you get when you want some conscious. Right. Real, you oh, know, that's he's a great representative. Common. He's well balanced, he's balanced, yeah. his, his temperament is very balanced. He, yeah, he's not he's aggressive, he's intelligent, he's yeah, well, he's, you know, yeah, he's, he's, he's articulate. Yeah, 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 yeah. he's like, still like, I approve of that. House. I mean, if you're gonna make somebody watch a ridiculous HR video about and you want it to feel authentic, are, right? You want to feel authentic, but yet intelligent and right. feel like someone that could actually be speaking to this, right? He's a great choice. I like, it. hey guys, I'm a black guy, you see, I'm not angry, <laughs> don't call the police on me. That's that's almost like textbook. We don't understand racism. All right, let's just get a black guy and cover right. our asses. You, well, no, no. I mean, you, what you what else them. could they do though? I mean, can, you tell just, them common. No matter whatever, well, no I matter wouldn't what hurt they, anyone. Well, no matter what they do, you're going to have something negative to say. <laughs> right. If they got a white person to come in and talk about it, you'd be like, "What is it?" Like, there's it's some. There's no. There's I would no win. absolutely appreciate it if they had a white person. You're being, being too. You're, you're, no, I'm not. You're, yeah, you are. I'm not, not being you're facetious too, at all. Are. I would totally appreciate it if they had a white person. Only if that white person was Jane. Elliot. I don't even know what that is. I don't either. You should. Uh, what? We shouldn't or should? You should. Who Jane is that? Jane Elliott. Matter of fact, there uh Jane Elliott <laughs> is the lady who has She's done the white person that who, has, who has done a, a number of teaching on racism. In fact, she does the okay. brown eyed, blue eyed. Oh, the test, the, do, right. the doll test. Okay. Right. I remember, I she do does know. she does those. She's okay. the she's the only person that I consider Are you serious right now? That though? actually does yes, she does you those trainings Starbucks for a living. To go get her? Yes. Okay. I don't even know who this woman is. If Starbucks didn't get Jane Elliott, the, today was a waste. I think today was a waste anyway. Sorry, but. common this is why hoteps will never get the respect because that, oh, that's that's completely irrational. That makes no sense. Why? Why? If you didn't get why? Jane you think Elliot, common? You think common is more? I mean, it didn't have to be common, but Jane. Like, I, I think they they try. This they is did what Jane Elliott job. does for a living. But maybe they didn't think about her. We didn't even know who she was. If I saw her, she could walk right beside me. I wouldn't. I know the test, but I don't know the person's name. Like, that's a dumb test, if you ask me. I. Oh my god. What? That test is dumb. What? <laughs> the test you're talking about where they, the, the black girls pick the white doll because the white doll is pretty? It's not dumb. It's very important. It's a dumb test. It's so important. A, As so a little test. black girl who grew up without black dolls. Well, that's you whose fault is that? Did? Whose it's fault is very that? very important. Blame your mama. No, but there weren't that many black dolls. Yeah, I bet there's some up. black guns in your grandma's. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> I mean, there's some black shotties. <laughs> anyway. I ain't never seen on. a white raffle. <laughs> Moving wow. on. So, what did you guys think about um, Kanye spending eighty thousand dollars for the picture of Whitney Houston's bathroom that was uh, coked out, uh, cracked out? <laughs> Crack is whack. Remember she said that? She did say that. It looked like it was that whack in that she, bathroom. I like become was, what I hate. It looked like it was a lot My of crack. My girlfriend took a sex to the picture. She was like, "What is this?" She was obsessed with figuring out what every single piece of. E- you know, if every single thing was on. She was like, "Is that a Kentucky Fried Chicken box?" Like, How, she was zooming. She the was hell zooming in because it was like it's just so much paraphernalia on this. On this staff infection everywhere. <sighs> I, I I thought that was it was an extremely poor taste. Do you yeah, guys that, even understand why that would make sense to be the cover of his album? No, what was the name of the album? Daytona. Yeah, that didn't make any sense either. That made no sense. But think, why would Kanye pick that? I mean, I'm trying it to doesn't like, have to make any sense. It's provocative. It's, yeah. it's the people it going. It gets the people going. <laughs> and it did. I mean, when people are talking about it, but it's, it was in extremely poor taste. Yeah, it was awful. And, and, if, you, and if you've listened to Pusha T, like, that's what he rap about. Coke? Crack. Yeah. Coke and crack. Yeah. Whether he shit or not. An expensive shit. As Drake said, when he smashed his ass... It was your yeah. cousin and your brother and you. <laughs> he did. So his you what you did. His brother what is you... now a, a religious, uh, yeah. in a religious. No malice. Yeah. yeah. Yes, no malice. He even made a joke about that. Like, it, oh, Drake man. killed him. But we'll, I guess we're going to get to Drake in a second. But yeah, well, yeah that, that, that album cover, I don't, I don't, I don't get it. I don't, I don't care that it's provocative. It just didn't really make any sense. It didn't fit. So it was. I just feel like it was disrespectful. I think Whitney, I think Whitney Houston did. She, she she had like this illustrious career, but then we also saw the crack is whack side of her. Like she 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 cheated with Tupac. 
she she had a lot of problems. You know she that? had a lot of no. she had a lot of issues. No, no, she, her Bobby was in an interview recently saying that it broke his heart. And why is he even talking about? We don't want to know this information, Bobby. Imagine your wife cheating on you well, with motherfucking Tupac. Well, you guys know that. Well, that's what um you remember uh, Todd one told us that Bobby was messing with Janet Jackson. Oh, okay, but look though, she cried for days after Tupac died. We all did. I didn't. I did. I didn't. I, did. I didn't. But Bobby Brown is like. I mean, he's sitting there watching his wife. He was happy. <laughs> I don't know about that, but yeah. So I don't understand the the, the need. It, it even though it is provocative and it's like it's it's kind of offensive. It is offensive. I think he wanted it to be offensive, though. I think he did too, which is weird to me. Like because the comments he made. Kanye, his mother, you know, his 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 mother passed away, and that obviously affect, impacted him. And I think the fact that he would not be sensitive to Whitney Houston's family because they had to see. Not only did she, you know destroy her life publicly in front of everybody but at least she could you know rest in peace like this is it's don't, just, this don't have nothing to do with her her resting i think it does i think she i she's, think it's, it's she's it's, been the worms ate her a long time oh ago oh my goodness you and these worms i mean that's where it ends not, it's the ground no, it and that's isn't. it no the, but i'm just saying the her ground legacy, and the worms and that's her it her legacy just let her uh, let her live let her let her rest in peace like, like there, why she is in we, peace there's there's this she's it. not because people are looking at her bathroom. bathroom the bathroom is like your most private place why in are, your bathroom here's a better question why are women's bathrooms so junky. <laughs> Tim, pretend like your bathroom Actually, is it? Is it? No, my, it I will stuff admit, on my up side, on, the counter, on my side man. is all kinds of stuff. Makeup junky. <laughs> yeah, it's all kinds of stuff. It's hair. That's, that's the real question. It may not it's be hair crack pipes, but equipment. it is wigs and eyelashes. It, it, there may be some eyelashes. <laughs> right. There's different types of hand soaps and mail that you opened and decided that you didn't feel like. I don't know. It wasn't. But that's what I'm saying. It's your bathroom. All these free samples. It's the, <laughs> it's the it's the it's the private place, like your bathroom in your room. There's nothing more private than that. Like that's just <laughs> that is not. First of all, what what family member or who sold the picture? Who gave who the right? Who took the picture and then said, "Hey, you know what? I'll save this for. I'm, say, I'm gonna save this for a few years. I'll put this up to an auction off at a well, price." Well, I think I think because I talked about it on uh, my page my page on Facebook, and someone had said that I, I guess someone in Bobby's family took the picture, and then they sold it to the Inquirer. And oh dear. I guess Kanye licensed it from yeah, the Inquirer. Yeah, he did. He did. Well, I, Bobby was wrong because we should know that all that crack wasn't just for Whitney. Some of that was his as well. And people are pushing it as Whitney Houston's, but maybe oh, that no, was, no, 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 it was no. a joint. Oh, no, it was no, no, no. Like, it came out a long time ago. How you going to try to push that on Bobby? Though? Yeah, I'm it just came out a long maybe time ago. Was a joint. I mean, Bobby was the good guy in that relationship. Yeah, right. That's what it came no, out a long time ago. Bobby was the angel. Bobby was the angel. They were equally... Whitney equally, Houston was an angel when she sang, but when she cut that mic off... Stop it. They were equally destruct. They were both self-destructing mm-hmm. alongside of each other. Bobby Bobby's was a king of R&B. Off. <laughs> she dubbed him that. I know. I mean, she I am not going to continue to blame Bobby for Whitney's nope. transgressions. Not at all. That but was a grown for, woman for with black girl to magic. S- to sell the, sell the picture, knowing that Bobby... Bobby didn't sell. You say his family. Somebody's his family. But don't I'm just say saying, Bobby. But they should have... Like, I don't know if that was true. It's not Whitney's... Yeah, but someone on my timeline. See you it's not just Whitney's bathroom. No. It could have been Whitney and Bobby. Maybe they had they they're rich, they have separate sides. But he could have put some of his on her side. No, man, you I don't, don't think that was crack. just all her. Your bathroom is where you keep your most intimate of substances. <laughs> I don't think that was just all her. I, I feel think like that a was some of bunch him. of subway rappers and stuff. That, it it was, was like I did I do think there was a contender. So how much of that you think was Bobby? 60, 40, 80, 20? I think half. Equally yoked. I think they were both did get, you see? Did you ever see the the, the 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 reality show with the two of them on there? Yeah, mm-hmm. he seemed they were like equally, he made no. He made a lot of sensible sensible statements. No, he didn't. There she was, was one episode where they were both like getting hemorrhoid cream for their eye. It was it, they oh, were, I remember that they were both together. Yeah, it was that. not one. It was to, it was two. I think it was her idea though. Uh, Crackheads have tricks. They know secrets. He is and too. Shit. He was too. That wasn't just her. I don't remember him ever saying he smoked crack. I remember her saying she smoked. He well, didn't agree. She he pretended didn't like it. she didn't because crack didn't was say black. It. I think it's even more offensive that they spent eighty thousand dollars on it. Yeah. That's even like you're so you want to do this so bad you're willing to spend almost a hundred thousand dollars on this picture. I just think that as an artist and as someone who lost his mother, he should have had more. To, he should have respected her legacy more than no. He but did. have you been looking at the the other tweets though between Kim Kardashian and Ron Fest? Yes, yes. So apparently oh he's not God. even paying for the, the yeah. his mom's. Well, foundation. I read I read I read a few articles on that. What happened is I guess Kanye claimed he was going through financial issues, and he told 
Ryan Fessy, he could not continue to fund it. So he hadn't been funding it in a while. But he could have $80,000 for a picture. He, yeah, but then, oh, so Ryan Fessy came back and recently and was like, he's not, when all this Drake's, he told Drake, yeah, can you help us pay for this? When you get that this? money. Yes, and, and um, uh, Kanye, and of course, Kim got all off in it, which I mean, I'm they're not married, mad. so yeah, I'm not she's mad. supposed to do, but... Kanye has, I mean, he obviously no longer wants to be involved. So I think they should change the name from his mother because he's not he's not involved with it. But yeah. you know, <sighs> which that's unfortunate. It is unfortunate. That's but, sad because that's, his mom didn't have anything to do with it. But Kanye's like, spinning. He's yeah, he's he's, he's spiraling. He's but light skin, light skin is coming back. I mean, we we never really left, what? but we show traces. Where did you get that from? Drake is the clapback king. Drake is is two for two. He okay. bodied Meek Mill. He bodied. Uh, he bodied this dude. What's his name? Push your team. But I mean, I, uh, come back, clap back. But I, I don't know about bodied. He bodied him. He he, he did. got he got a lick in. No, no he, he got a lick. No. See, matter of fact, here's no. the thing. I think, I, I, not, especially gonna, in terms of the light skin rap beef, Pusha T is somebody that like lyricists tend to respect. He does. He is. Yes. Meek Mill hadn't earned that respect. Not at all. So when they went at it, it was really like. You, they kind of instigated it to see Meek, but Meek and, and started Drake go it though. At it. So, and we he, were actually surprised that Drake did well. Like, oh, well, man, hell, he, he smashed that nigga. Killed, and, but then, he did, and then Meek made it worse. <laughs> yeah, he made it worse for himself. Right, but right. look though, no, but Drake, Pusha is not that. Drake didn't even just knock Pusha out off the off the ring out the ring. He just stated a lot of facts. That, that Quinn Miller stuff. He smashed. He smashed the whole thing. Everybody. Uh, he's everybody who's ever said anything about him getting somebody to write for him or whatever. Yeah. He smashed all of them. He is the comeback clapback king. I don't care what you say. I he's would got like, like to see four songs on the radio right now that dominate that nobody we can't hear any other music besides his. I would like to see him and Kendrick have a beef like Jay Z. Nah, I do. I do. No, Ooh, I don't want them to have Drake a beef. Drake and Kendrick. Yeah, I would like to see that. Now Kendrick think, is too. I conscious. think that'd be. No, I think that'd be worthy. You're not supporting beef. We want no, 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 no. Just the, the spirit no. of take over ether. That's like that's monumental competition. Yes, but they actually had real beef. Yeah, but they, okay. <laughs> we don't I, need that. I don't, want, like I don't like want real beef. To, I don't want real Jay-Z beef. Jay-Z and Nas had real issues. Like, but, yeah, but he signed to the dude, so it wasn't that real. Well, but they had issues at and, that and time. Nas, and Nas actually held back. Did he? Yeah, Nas held back. Why? I saw, I, I saw something that it was in, was it Summer Jam or something like that? He was going to, he had a, like a robot of, of Jay-Z made... And what? it was going to have a noose around him, so he was going to bring Jay Z hanging out We're on stage or some shit. I'm glad Nas didn't do that. That it, would it not have been very Nas like. Yeah. That's kind of that sounds like he's trying way too hard. Yeah. We don't. We don't. I well, don't you believe know, it's, that. It's, Nas. it's blood sport. I don't believe Nas it's would blood do that. Sport. He's way it too is. cool. For I that. would like. I would like to see. Um, I'd like to see them battle. Just those two. From what I, I just got a text message that Pusher came back. So. I oh, get wow. while, another one. What happened? While while we're while we're recording the shade room, uh, whoa! <laughs> I guess we we'll, let's go straight to it. <laughs> <laughs> Special bulletin. Breaking news. <laughs> this just in. <laughs> the story of Adidon. That's what it looks like. Oh God! Unearths photo of Drake in blackface. Oh, that actually is Drake. Wow, that is him. It actually is Drake. Let me see what you're looking Why at. Why is he? What? What? What's happening? That's actually Drake. Oh no! So what we're looking at here, you're gonna see it tomorrow. Oh! But wait a no. minute! Wait a minute! Wait a minute! Before we go, put hold, hold on. This is this is this is on the shade room right now. Mm -hmm. It just it just dropped a few minutes ago, and it says this is an artwork, no Photoshop, actual photo by David Leyes, and it's Drake in blackface in a green hoodie. <laughs> With the crow, he's got a crow on his shirt too, like the little, oh, the little, yeah. the little jive oh, turkey crow. He did mince. This is this is Drake in in minstrel show. <laughs> Virginia Williams shan't ever be mentioned this time or anyone. Oh, oh, oh man, this is what awful. Is this? I don't know, but it's awful. These are his truths. See for yourself. Like we're literally experiencing this right now, yo. Like so, when y'all are talking about, like we're all seeing this shit at the same time. There's a song called "The Story of Adidon." I almost feel like we need to we need to cut and listen to it and then come back. All right, so we're Let's gonna we're that. gonna take yeah. a pause. Real <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna do this right now. Take a pause, real quick. Oh shit! It's about to go down. Right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um. So uh, what I said a few minutes ago. <laughs> so I take all that back. I don't know about taking it all back, but uh. This might be the one. I don't. Maybe we don't need Kendrick. 
I mean, okay, my th- okay. Are there? I guess when there's there's no rules to this thing. There don't there don't appear to be. But there, I mean, I guess when Remy, Remy, Remy Ma and Nicki Minaj, there weren't any rules. There are no rules. There are no rules. This. I mean, for him to out Drake's son, having a son, and, and like with a porn, a porn star. star that is, I mean, that's, 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 that is, you, you don't get any more personal than that. Like, I know, right? And then say, man, just go ahead and make your world. Yeah, like man. that, like just, that just puts him in a, like, wedding oh ring like it's a bad thing. Uh, he embarrassed him and shamed him all in the same verse. Like, you got a porn star as your baby mom, but you should go ahead and do the right thing, sir. Then he brought up the fact that his dad left when he was young and like, like he just his mom is losing. Like uh, what? Um, the baby's cutting up the pie. Like it, oh, the yeah, ends ain't the same yeah. when babies yeah, whatever. But babe, yeah, uh, this is what we wanted from Meek. It is. This is what we You're wanted right. from Meek. And, however many summers ago that was. Yeah. And then the picture, like first of all, <laughs> first of all, sh- <laughs> forget Whitney's. Forget Whitney's uh, bathroom, okay? Yeah. They, for, that was Whoever nothing. found the picture of Drake, like, it looks like he's a teenager, then he's young, a lot younger, yeah. in yeah. blackface. Right. Looking like the corniest. Like, the, the cooniest. The, exactly. Yeah. He's making light-skinned people look bad. Now, I remember I said and, he, he's making well, us look good. And then even threw that in, your afro wouldn't curl enough. It wouldn't right. happen. But that, but now, that's, now, that's not right because that is shaming. That is, that, it, Drake can't No, that's can't really help. funny, though. It's, it's fair. It is funny, but I'm it's just fair. saying you can't make fun of someone because they're biracial. Fair jab. You absolutely can. It's a fair jab. It's a fair jab. Yeah, you can absolutely Man, can. Man, yeah. his son, though. I, I, so, if Drake has, I'm I'm pretty sure. But Drake's it seems not like going to be able to say nothing. He can't say nothing racial back to push it out. No, he can't. He can't. It's like not the fat now. woman. Now, no, after the, period. After the, after the, no, after no, the minstrel show thing. No, people can't say anything back After to that him. minstrel show picture, there's absolutely nothing he should say. That's true. Well, he couldn't say anything before, but extreme, especially after that. Mm-mm. Especially don't after that. Don't you still got, like, cornrows? I don't he want might. him to do anything. Hey, <laughs> we don't. Might. Hey, we don't want black. Hey, it's it's a real it's a real sensitive time right now. No. <laughs> and Drake is on the cusp, but with the with the Jewish mother and all. Okay, so I, I don't know, think he can do. I don't think he can make jokes like that. I know that we're just off the 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 heels of hearing it twice because Kevin wanted to go back and hear it again. What do you think? Who's winning? I mean, right now, push I your think whatever winning. whatever licks I thought. <laughs> well, I, no, I think on the last one Drake did get a lick in he did. on Pusher. He did, but, he did but this one. is no Meek. But this is no Meek. Yeah, exactly. Because exactly. not only is he lyrical, but he also is very resourceful. Yeah, because he got information. I mean, that picture no, number one. Yo, Pusher just smacked the shit out of him in front of everybody. Yo, yeah. and, I, and right he, now did he already did like, that as, though. In the schoolyard of hip hop, everybody right. is going, Ooh, you gonna let him do that shit to you, man? Yeah. Yo, we instigating wow. the fuck out of this shit right now. Know, but Diddy slapped him in, in public before. And slapped who, Drake? Drake, yeah. Yeah, but that don't count, though. Because Diddy has a lot of money. Pusher yeah. is Pusher is coming from a place below Drake as far as money yeah, goes. And, he's, and he just ate his ass up. up. Yeah. And that's, that is some shit that, how do you respond to that? Though? No, you got it, but this, he got it. He has he to, has but I'm to. just saying, what do you, I mean, now he, a whole Ooh. son. Hey, that, that, a whole son. That invoice don't look so hot now. <laughs> right, like, oh, that shit. shit was funny though. But oh. that shit was funny, but it doesn't, oh, it doesn't. Uh, my water. <laughs> Damn. I wasn't <laughs> expecting that. I gotta say. Yeah. I wasn't expecting that. Perfect way to end the show, though. I'm glad we got it before the show was yeah, over. So that, now that, 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 we don't have to wait a whole week to even yeah. to bring it up. But man, I don't know what what is Drake gonna like. I, how I is just, Drake gonna respond to that? Because Drake is good with like stuff that's obvious, and he he's he's intelligent, so he can make. But I don't. But uh, hiding a son with a porn star, like he's got to address that. He but that was that. that's what was so crazy about Drake doing this. Anyway. Drake might want to just take the L. No, he might can't take that. He can't. He'll never. He'll yeah, never he'll recover because so many people want him to to fail. He yeah. will not recover yeah. from if he doesn't come back. He's it's a wrap. Yeah, it's forget a rap. rap. He can he can just continue to do his songs and he'll be fine. Because nah. Drake, no Drake makes good music. This shit will was blow the same. over. Nothing was the same. Nothing was the same. Nothing was the same. He'll, he'll drop that. another uh-uh. controller. Nah, he'll drop yeah. one of those. Ain't nobody, ain't nobody dropping nah. that. Anybody going nah. to that? But he nah. ain't gonna be able to do no, no heavy bars. No, he's not more, gonna be able to do that either nah. because that's ain't only, no back to back. That only nah. works when you are considered relevant and cool. Like that Ooh. just Ooh. <laughs> that Ooh. was bad. It's that was push, bad. Push grimy, man. Ugh. Yeah, that was that's, grimy. That, but I mean, like I said, that that's was, like Nikki and, and Remy. I mean, like they both went 
deep. Nah, that point. wasn't anything compared to this. Remy and Nikki's beef. One, Remy's, nah. Remy's, 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 Remy's initial. Was. That's what I'm saying. Remy's like she just was. went below the belt. But I guess all is fair. That shit is crazy. Like he has to address that, and he has to come back and put. First of all, he has to redeem himself. Then he got to come back and push. And I don't know. To me, if he says anything back in a rap, that's redeeming himself. But he can't just redeem himself. He has to cut this dude. Yeah. Because that dude just cut him. <laughs> but I'm, I got to cut you. <laughs> right. But is he? But if but but the the bad part about that though, I'm afraid that Pusha may have more because he he was very relaxed. Like he was like he may have more. Like if you and got if you got the information <laughs> about the son and the stripper and all this, there may be more. He may want to back the fuck up. But like, especially and, and see. The, Here's the crazy part Hold too. Hold on, Pusha got Crystal cursing. Did you hear that? She <laughs> yeah, said, "Back yeah. the fuck up." Right. Rewind. Right. If you didn't hear that, rewind. <laughs> rewind fifteen seconds. Yo, but he chose. He chose to beat the Jay Z used from the story of OJ. Right. Very mild. Yeah. yeah it's, very. It's, it's not subliminal. a raw, raw. But it's a very, raw. A very subliminal. Yeah. yeah. Yo, very subliminal. Yeah. It, it went along with the minstrel show shit, so that that kind of works. How did this all fall together like this? But man? if it's, he it's, come it's with perfect. some hard, like if he come with some ether, some like Ooh. a takeover Ooh, Drake, beat, that Drake? type. No, Pusha. Oh. If push you already do something Pusha's like that, a, a response to yeah, Drake's you, response. Like, you're, you're already here, so you're you're picking push over the, on this anyway. Is it because he's darker skinned? <laughs> Are you really just hating the, the light skinned dude? No, I'm just recognizing I, LeBron and Pusha in seven. He is. He oh, basically just down. told you that light skin is going over. Down. Oh man, dark skin is back. Well, Drake, we're waiting. I can't wait to hear. Drake's it. gonna have to respond like good tonight. luck, nigga. To, to, <laughs> Drake needs to respond ASAP. Yeah. ASAP, like he don't need to wait too long. Yeah, he got twenty four hours. Yeah, pretty much twenty four hours. Damn, how did how did we get here? I don't know. Internet internet speeds everything up. No, I mean how did this how shit did just Drake came and, out during the how taping? How did Drake and Pusha Beef get here? Like, where, oh no, but Pusha had been has been saying some stuff about Young Money for a while, so it's been there. Mm-hmm. It's, it's kind of been there, but Drake never responded to him. Yeah, I think Pusha's been like. One day he's going to respond to me And, and I can't going, wait and, this nigga and I got all this information <laughs> right. Ready to go I think he got more Because that's too perfect Yeah That song was the, yeah. the beat The, the, the picture, visual yeah, That's just too perfect Yeah I think Drake That's an exercise in lyricism boy. <laughs> <sighs> Yeah <sighs> We are uncomfortable Yeah Yeah I'm uncomfortable You did Yeah Yeah <laughs> Well We appreciate you guys Tuning in once again <laughs> To Music Love Life Good luck Drake lovers uh, yeah, you know, it might, I mean, he's had a good run. Drake's had a good run. Are we going live? Yeah. We might. We've had yeah. a good, Drake's had I a good run. I think Drake's show. just completely quit rap. Him and Maxwell should do like a duet album or something. Wow, really? You it's, just, you just, you, you, you just d- abandon your light see, skin uh, brother quickly. Like, y'all, y'all don't have no loyalty. You just, that's, you that's just drop That's the base him. code. No, no, <laughs> no. If, if, you're, if you're part of our Slack room for the No Nonsense show, you know we always go at Maxwell anyway. Maxwell's like, but now you, but now you've even, grouped Drake in with him? <laughs> It's, it's about to happen. But I'm just saying, you just, you just. I know. I'm evolving the during the show. I'm <laughs> evolving during the show. You have no. Can you see my growth? This is why <laughs> you should call that growth. This is nah, you, I think I think you on a dark skin bandwagon. <laughs> no, it's not. I that. think that's what it is. It's I think you on a dark skin bandwagon. He just abandoned his light skin. Yeah. I've never liked Drake, but I just liked that he was clapping at niggas. I thought that he was I, his soul. You said that I light skin was bad. It is. You were all. It no, was. It, it, mm-hmm. it was until ten minutes ago. He was all for the beige party. <laughs> it was. It was back to ten minutes ago. Song. Right. Y'all keep trying to stifle us. We were. We were well, back. You mm-hmm. We were back. Push ahead. He had. Push and put on that ski mask. I said rat. Yeah. This. I, oh shit! I, I've never liked Drake's women songs. I don't like them. But the comebacks, like the comebacks. I was saying he's a comeback king. He's dancing. Cla- he's a clapback king. The comeback king. But I don't know that he's. I think that may have just been interrupted. Might have been the end. Arrested development. <laughs> Oh, this man. is Drake's Arrested Development. I can't wait to hear what happens in the morning. I mean, because it's already it's 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 already brewing. There were like forty thousand views. Yeah, and on, and on TMZ, what we like all these outlets are like yeah. going in. Like the 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 son. Everybody name, don't even know yet. The son's right. name, the the mom's name, and the the, the shame. <laughs> the, the, it's just it doesn't feel good, guys. Doesn't well, feel good. I hate to I hate to do this to light skin people, but I want you to like, share, and subscribe <laughs> on the back of Drake getting. Hey, push it, push it, did Nino Brown and it, pretty motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> Never liked him anyway. I hated that scene. Oh, I hated that scene. Kevin is loving this. We'll see. We'll see what happens. This is good. Hip hop is back. This is good. It's it's gonna be a long summer. <laughs> Surgical summer. <laughs> Eighteen. See you guys next week. Love life.